Hey guys, today, um, well, yesterday I picked up this uh, Ryobi um, eight, eight inch uh, cordless pruning chainsaw. So it's 18 volt. So it's their 18 volt one plus system. So yeah, uh, I guess eight inch blade. Um, yeah, eight inch cordless chainsaw. So it's battery powered. Um, it comes with the, uh, you'll, you'll see here, it says it comes with uh, the tool only. So there's no battery and no charger. So you'll need to buy that separately. Turns out the battery, depending on which battery you get, can go anywhere from probably $30 to like $100. And there's a big difference in the batteries and the amp hours that they provide. Um, but fortunately, I just purchased a drill that has uh, that comes with a charger and two batteries. So we're gonna use one of those batteries to power this thing. We're gonna see, it should be compatible. We're gonna see how it works. So we're gonna unbox this and do a quick demo of it. So let's break this guy open right now. All right, so let's see what we got here. First thing we're gonna pull out is, I guess, this piece of cardboard. And uh, here is the actual chainsaw. Look at that, and the battery would go on here. Um, thing covering up the blade. There's the chainsaw blade. Um, yeah, got some sharp edges on there. Um, yeah, there's the eight inch chainsaw blade. Look at that, there it is. This is the uh, eight inch Ryobi chainsaw. So, and uh, you know, you got your grip over, grip here, grip here, uh, you know, hand guard here. Uh, what else do we have on this thing? So here's the trigger. I haven't tested this out yet or read the manual or anything, but it looks like, see this thing? You have to hold this down. You'd have to hold this in place and then pull the trigger. So unlock it or, you know, take the safety off, hold that, and then you can cut like this. And as soon as you let go of it, it's gonna just stop. So you'd hold this down and then when you're ready to actually cut, cut, and then let go of it. I, I imagine that's how it works, but I haven't tested it yet. Um, on this little handle here, it has a, it comes with this wrench tool. Um, so I'm not familiar with this at all. I just picked this up at Home Depot because it looked like an excellent thing to have on hand. And um, yeah, I haven't even looked at what this, this tool would be for, but I imagine it's for taking this blade off for like maintenance and stuff. But uh, yeah, in the handle, it comes with that little tool. Similar to how the angle grinder, I just recorded a video with my new angle grinder and that also came with a tool that came inside the handle that's similar to this, but the tool had two little teeth that help you take the blade off the angle grinder. So anyways, yeah, you can see, I bet if you were to take this thing off, um, yeah, it looks like that actually fits this. It fits on this, this uh, bolt here and you could actually take this guard off and swap out Looks like you can swap out the, the chain and the blade right here. So um, yeah, we're not doing that in this video, maybe another video, but um, I guess let's look look at what else is in the box. Um, not a whole lot and uh, all right, so it comes with this metal piece. I haven't looked at what this is for yet. And uh, what else do we have in here? Looks like we just have the manual and I think that's everything. Let's see, extra piece of cardboard, throw that aside. So we've got a manual and uh, we've got this help system, cordless one. Huh, all right, so I don't know what this, all right, 40 volt, all right, so I think the higher end, um, so this is 18 volt, but I think the higher end, like the bigger chainsaws are actually 40 volt. Um, any case, yeah, a bunch of manual related stuff, things like that, um, that's all fine and great. Um, let's pop on the battery. So this is the battery that came with my drill. And um, so I got the drill in here, I'll just show you real quick. I already did the video unboxing this guy, but this is the, the 18 volt drill. Did a whole separate video on that. Um, we should probably have it posted by now. By the time you're watching this video, that video should have already been posted, but um, you might wanna go check our, our videos. We have a bunch of different things. But yeah, this is the one of the two batteries that came with it. And um, so this is a 18 volt, 1.5 amp hour lithium battery and you will see that, so that 1.5 amp hours, um, that should be how long it will last. They have some that are like four, and um, some that are even, I think they have some that are more than that. I haven't gone through them all yet, but they have different options of amp hours, so they'll last longer, and the battery is gonna be actually be thicker on some of the, the larger batteries. Anyways, let's uh, stick this guy in here. Snaps right in, works perfectly. Um, Let's test this out. So now 
pulling the trigger is going to basically do nothing, but pull the safety off and then pull the trigger. There you go. That is the chainsaw functioning. I feel like I should cut something with this. I know we're, I'm gonna take this out and cut like some branches or something with it for the rest of this video. But while we're here, I'm gonna try cutting the box just to cut something. Let's see here. So yeah, it cuts through that box pretty quick. That's pretty excellent. Um, and this battery has not been, I have not charged it. This is the power that it has out of the box. So there's that too, that's worth considering. Um, yeah, pull this down, pull the trigger. There you go, nice working chainsaw. As always, be careful with power tools and especially chainsaws. I've seen people have these come flying up and almost hit themselves in the head. Um, you know, don't hit anything with the tip of it and so on and so forth. Know what you're doing, um, use your best judgment and be careful, you know, wear safety glasses and all that sort of stuff. So that's about it on this, um, well, except for this part of the video anyways. So we're gonna switch over now to our demo cutting branches and wooden stuff.